Happy Friday. I've got a great mix of stories for you today, so don't move because you're watching Listen Up. Time for a quick weather check. It's going to be bright and sunny again today with a high of 86 degrees. If you had issues with the A train this morning, this next story could be the reason why. A man was hit by a train this morning at Liberty Avenue in Queens. NYPD's bomb squad rushed to the scene after police discovered he jumped the tracks while carrying a suspicious package. The victim was taken to the hospital and all was deemed safe. It looks like Amazon is making moves in New York after all. The e-commerce company is reportedly looking to snag some serious office space on Fifth Avenue in Manhattan, where Lord & Taylor's flagship used to be. The Wall Street Journal anticipates the space could likely hold more than 4,000 employees. If you haven't already heard, Amtrak's latest upgrade would have us brunching in D.C. and back home in no time. Amtrak just announced plans to launch a non-stop train service from D.C. to New York. Commuters will now be able to ride the Acela back and forth throughout the work week without a single stop. Tickets go on sale September 23rd. Hey, I'm at the Fortnite World Cup where they normally play the U.S. Open in Queens, now taken over by this video game phenomenon. 30 million in prize money up for grabs. Swipe up for more. All right, that's it for today's show, but real quick before you go. News 4 and Telemundo supporting our school's back to school drive is happening right now. Join us all day tomorrow at more than 60 Raymore and Flanagan locations across the tri-state area.